I'm here at South Lake Hospital to get a procedure done to better my voice so I will be able to communicate with my friends. I'll see you after the procedure and I'm sure everything will be all well. Vocal cord paralysis can happen to anyone. There's the cancer patients who have lymph nodes that are pushing on the nerve. There's patients who are having surgery of any kind in and around their head and neck area, which is where the nerve runs. Um, and then there's just the average person who unfortunately gets a cold or a virus and for whatever reason, the nerve to the vocal cord is affected. We have two vocal cords and they sit in our neck around here. And the way they work is they open when we take a breath and they close, come together when we speak. And occasionally, if one of the vocal cords is not working, or has been paralyzed for whatever reason, then that vocal cord doesn't move and it sits off to the side. And then the working vocal cord is no longer able to touch it to be able to get sound out. Injection laryngoplasty is a procedure where we're injecting a paste or a gel next to a paralyzed vocal cord to be able to generate voice. The previous way that this procedure was done was under a general anesthetic. It required patients coming in, fasting, um, having to go through the whole preoperative process, check-in, uh, prolonged stay in hospital. And we're now able to do it from the outside and are able to do it um, with the patient awake. So not only does that avoid the need for a general anesthetic, patients are able to walk in and walk out within 30 minutes and have the procedure done. It's been a month since I've had this procedure at South Lake, and now I'm talking better and my friends, my family is, are happy to hear me speak. I feel it's a miracle. It's a miracle what things can be done these days, or else I'd be sentenced to a life of whispering and writing notes the rest of my life. I think that says a lot about Southlake. We have a lot of physicians in our department and in other departments who are always looking for new innovations to improve patient care, improve patient experience, and improve um, you know, what we can offer at the, the hospital.